We are here with Rachel Lamb, editorial assistant on Luxury Daily. Rachel, you've written the story on this new Rolls Royce application for the Phantom car. Mm -hmm. Everything looks good, but. Um, well, the thing that I thought was, it was really missing is that it didn't have anything that. Uh, that you know, aspirational buyers could have. It's kind of a teaser. They have you know, luggage, and there's a picnic basket, and it shows it you know in a Rolls Royce uh, car and everything. Um, but you can't buy it, and it doesn't really tell you anywhere where you can buy it. Um, and that's interesting to me because the app is definitely for the uh, aspirational buyer. Um, you know, people that you know, car enthusiasts that they like Rolls Royces, or you know, they might hope that one day they'll be able to afford one. Because those that can afford to buy a Rolls Royce car probably aren't going to get the idea that they want one by, you know, designing a car on the app and then bringing it into the dealership and saying, you know, I want this car. They already know that they want it or they know of it. Um, and I think that those who can't buy it might want to still be part of the brand experience. Um, a lot of luxury automakers have hats and driving gloves and scarves and picnic baskets and luggage and stuff that... Uh, Rolls Royce does uh, kind of advertise on their app, but it's not able to be bought. So I think that's kind of a problem. Mm. Big problem, big car. <laughs>